Deadly school shooting in Parkland is on the mind of pop star Demi Lovato. She is kicking off her new tour with a focus on mental health, and she invited five survivors of the school shooting on stage with her last night. She's asking fans to help provide mental health support to the Parkland community. CBS News correspondent Maria Villarreal was at last night's concert and spoke exclusively with Lovato about her mission behind the music. I got all these Demi Lovato hit a personal note in front of more than 7,000 fans at the debut night of her Tell Me You Love Me tour. Opening up about her own struggles with depression and addiction. I, got all these I want to share my journey with people and my story so that it can open people's minds and see that there's nothing wrong with you just because you have a mental illness. The Grammy-nominated singer-songwriter has battled bipolar disorder for eight years. Mike Bayer was instrumental in her recovery. I will forever be in debt to him for coming into my life and providing me with a place that was safe um, and believing in me. Now business partners, they use the concert tours to inspire others suffering from mental illness to seek help. A lot of Demi's music it allows for healing and it's how do you turn sadness or uh, just a tragic situation into inspiration and empowerment. Moved by the images of the Florida school shooting, Lovato personally reached out to some of the students on social media, concerned about their mental health after living through the tragedy. Seeing something that disturbing um, is just painful to watch and my heart goes out to them. On February 14th, one of the worst mass shootings in American history took place. These students were in the school that day. Please welcome them to the stage. She invited survivors to her concert last night to share their stories. There has been talk about obviously wanting to use this shooting for gun reform, but you think this is an opportunity to talk about mental health. It has nothing to do with politics. It's about healing. And it was how can we help these students heal from what they've been through. The students that came here today and shared their stories are so incredibly brave and courageous and they really are warriors in my eyes. I'm a survivor in more ways than you know. While she continues her own journey of healing, the pop star says she's committed to fighting the stigma attached to mental illness, one performance at a time. So ashamed, so confused, but I'm not That's beautiful and good for her for, you know, doing everything she can to decrease the stigma of mental illness and try to get the word out there. Well, she's brave to talk about her own struggle. And I think that for young people, especially who are fans of her music, they hear her talk about her own issues and feel like, well, maybe I can sort of talk about what, what I'm facing as yeah, well. And, and get help. And get help, exactly.